Today is the second meeting for the newly formed Finance Advisory Committee for the Savannah Chatham County School System. They're planning to receive updates that will help them decide what their goals should be this year. WTOC Shay Schrader is joining us live. Shay, this committee is still very new, but its purpose isn't. Yeah, Aria, that's exactly right. This new Finance Advisory Committee is actually replacing the old Budget Committee. So they are absorbing the responsibilities of the Budget Committee, but they're also going to have the power to dig deeper into the school system's finances and really make decisions based off of how money is being spent. And of course, they do uh, have the responsibility of also prioritizing how that money is being spent and keeping track of how much money the school system has. At today's meeting, the committee will be briefed on quality basic education, which is a Georgia law that helps fund education for kids kindergarten through 12th grade. Understanding how much money the system gets from QBE will help them make budget decisions for the next school year. An important note, school systems that gain more full-time students receive additional funding, but those with declining enrollment don't lose money, which the Savannah Chatham County Public School System has been struggling with. Now, I spoke with David Bringman, who is the chairman of the committee after their first and original meeting, and he said that he really wants to encourage the public to attend these meetings because this is where decisions are made, and that's the time to kind of weigh in with your thoughts and opinions uh, before those decisions get made and not after the fact. That meeting is today at 9 a.m. and it has been moved to the auditorium of Jenkins High School if you want to attend. For now, live in Savannah, Shay Schrader, WTOC News. Well, for the latest